All right, welcome to this workout. We're gonna get started right away with a warm up. Included in that warm up will be the techniques for today's workout. I'll go through them slowly, showing different angles. Then we'll go through them with repetition at about 60%. Make sure at all times that you're doing what's good for you. For beginners, remember, increase your repetitions, increase the time, and then eventually increase the rounds. For intermediate, you can work on two to three rounds and moving towards advanced level workout up to four and even five rounds. Okay, let's get started with a little warm up just to loosen up. Okay, let's open the stance. Okay, let's work the shoulders. And reverse direction. Keep your knees soft. Never do anything that's gonna cause you to strain. If you feel shortness of breath, dizziness, or any strain in the muscles, tightness, make sure to ease up or even stop. Okay, and take a break. Keep some water nearby at all times. Keep yourself fresh and hydrated. All right, good. Let's move on now to the midsection. Hands up here on the head. Okay, we're going to go with a very easy twist. Knees are bent. Just remain natural, not forcing. Okay, let's go side to side. And even now, bring your hands in front, like a guard. This is a modified version of Bob and weave. Okay. Go forward. Back. Forward. Bending at the waist. As we do this now, let's take one step forward. Okay. Into our guard position. All right. And forward. Back. Forward. Back, again, forward, back, forward, back, let's switch sides, forward, back, back, I want to emphasize more of the back, don't throw your head back, keep your head up, eyes looking forward. Okay, so back forward here, we go back, okay, eyes looking forward, duck, side, side, let's go over to your right, circle around, back the other way, keep the top of your head up, eyes up, all right, good, let's bring those knees up. Knees up, up toward the elbow, up toward the elbow. Keep your arm in 90 degree position and try to get your knees up, okay? As best you can, up to the elbow. All right, good job. All right, we're going to continue the warm up with the techniques. Our first technique is Hanuman Hot Dan. Hanuman Hot Dan. Okay, let's take a, actually, let's take a mid stance, hands up. With your right side, we want to swipe. 
swipe. Yeah, just like that. Okay. Concentrating on the inner fist and the forearm area. Swipe across. Swipe. And now the other side. Nice and easy. Let me give you another angle. Okay. And swipe. All right, great. Okay, for the next <coughs> for the next technique, ka jik kai, ka jik kai. Okay, you're standing in a basic stance. Most of you will be familiar with this because it looks like a jab. We go full one, two, three, four. Five, other side, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, good. Let's go once again. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Good job. Now let's go from the guard stance. Okay, and it's the forward hand. One, 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 one. Okay, I'm going to turn to this angle, switching the guard. One, 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 one. Okay, good. All right, for our last movement, we're going to go with a kick. Right? You're going to be switching your stance into a kick on Kok Kuang Prakan. On Kok Kuang Prakan. All right, good. So, before we begin, let's start here, okay, in our neutral stance. We're going to come up with your left side, your left side. All right, we're going to come up here. One, again, one, one. One, one more, one, and the other side, one, 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 two more, one, last time, one, all right, good, make sure to keep your body up straight as you're doing that, okay, good, okay, so continuing for the next part of that movement, what I want you to do is with your right, turn, turn that foot, okay? Turn that foot out, bring that leg up, just like that. One, two, one, two, one, two. Other side, one, turn, two, one, two. One, two. Notice my knee is coming up right here. It's not crossing my center line. It's not doing this. And it's not this. All right? Come right up right there. Up right there. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, so from there, we go into the final step of this movement, and it's the kick. You're going to be using the flat part of your foot, the bottom of your foot, <clears throat> not the toe, all right? Not the heel, it's just the whole, the sole of your foot, okay? We're going to go nice and easy. One, two, and then extend out for three. Okay, let's go to the other side. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. All right, without hesitation, let's go one, two, three, and begin. All right, 
good. Okay, if you need to take a break, do so at this time. Grab a few sips of water, catch your breath, and we'll move on. We'll move on to the next phase, which is the 60%, about 60 to 70% uh, performance of the techniques. And then after that, we'll move on to the circuit workout. All right. Okay. We're going to get started right away at about 60, 70% along with the circuit workout. Okay. So let me just review for you quickly the techniques we're doing. The first movement is Hanuman Hakdan. Hanuman breaks the barrier. Hanuman breaks the barrier. All right. And for the second movement, Ka Chi Kai. The crow pecks the egg. And for our last uh, technique, which is the kick, On Kot Kuang Prakan. On Kot swings the sword. Okay, good. All right. Just a little bit of information there for you. Write that down in your notebook. All right, here we go. Okay. We're going to work these movements in combination. All right. We're going to work these in combination starting off for the first uh, couple of repetitions at an easy pace, and then we'll pick it up. All right. We'll work both the left and the right side. I'll be changing the angle, but you just continue to work your right or your left as you are. All right, here we go. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and take our first stance, okay? Left or right starting off for you is up to you, but we do wanna work both sides, okay? So our first movement, Hanuman Hakdan. Hands up and knees are soft, swipe, swipe. Right? Okay, we're going to work that together with <clears throat> Ka Chi Kai. Okay, let's go to our other side. Technique on Kuk Kuang Prakan. Okay, so what I'm going to do for you here is turn here. Okay, nice and easy. We're going to be turning that front foot. Remember, we have to turn the foot. <coughs> turn the foot. Turn the foot. Turn your front foot. Front foot turns out. It's as you're taking a step. of those in the combination into our circuit workout. Let's get started. Okay, the name of the movements I will just count off as one, two, three. Okay, nice and easy first. One, two, three. One, two, three.
One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, from here now let's let's do some push-ups. Do the best you can. Okay, we're gonna go with 20 push-ups. 20. If necessary, you need to do modified push-up. You can do so in this fashion. Go in a push-up position. Let your knees drop, feet up. Notice that my back is still straight, okay? Now, for those of you who are going to do the regular push-up here, and begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Great, great, great. Very good. All right. Now, for those of you who were not able to reach 20 at one time, take your time. Try to finish it one by one, or you set a goal for yourself to increase the number of repetitions on your next workout. All right, good. We're going to move on now to squats. Squats with a narrow stance, okay? Right, right, just inside of shoulder width. If you're not sure about shoulder width, just look at where your arm, where your hand comes down. Okay, your hand is in line with the shoulder. So that would be shoulder width. Okay, my feet are just outside of my hands, right there. So inside a narrow stance in here, your hand should still swing freely without hitting your legs. Okay, so from here, we're gonna squat. Let's go with 20. Hands up as you go down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let me give you ten. Another angle. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. All right, good job. Good job. Now from here, we're going to move into a leg lift, standing leg lift. Okay. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, increase that number for yourself as you go along. We're going to finish this off 
with 25 jumping jacks. Ready? Make sure you're on a good surface, soft. If not, make sure you put on a sports shoe or a shoe with rubber bottom. Do not perform on a wood floor or tile or linoleum with socks. Okay, you don't want your foot to slip. Here we go, 25. And begin, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1 more. Stop. Hey. Hey, good job. Good job. Once again, beginners, increase your repetitions. All right? Increase your time doing the repetitions and, and the round. If you can work yourself up to a three minute round doing any of these movements together, that's great. Uh, intermediate, you can work on two to three rounds and those moving, moving on to advance would work on four up to five rounds, all right? Hey, you guys are gonna be great. Stick with it, all right? Stick with it. Motivate yourself. Be the inspiration and motivation for yourself. If you're able to get through the day and then rise to the next day, that's reason enough to do something to enhance your being, all right? I wish you peace of mind, good health, be strong. See you in your next training session. Take care.